so now these uniforms here we have thoughts about these uniforms let's first tackle the orlando apollo's uniform (laughs) interesting uniform choice like i think i think I, i like the look overall um tj what are your thoughts i think i like it um the balance of colors might be a little bit off perhaps the the shoulders being blue personally i would like to see more orange coming from a high school that was blue and orange it's always kind of hard to do two primary colors and so they clearly are going for orange to be the accent color and i respect that but i think they could have done something really cool if they incorporated more orange into their uniform um but again that's just me and this the front of that helmet come on guys arrowhead that's all i need the front of the helmet needs to have some type of arrowhead there like i feel like we're in agreement there slightly a missed opportunity but i don't hate them they're they're cool they're cool cool look cool look overall now the atlanta legends with the purple jersey the old gold pants with that sweet helmet you know got a little got a little flare on the shoulders here i think I think I like this look. I love this look. It's really good, and it is a great utilization of they have a dark primary color and a lighter primary color, and they don't need to mess around with white outlines. Like Maybe there's black on there. I can't tell, but it reads good from afar. I'm sure it looks even better up close, and it works super well with the helmet. Overall, well-put-together look. I like it a lot. And did you see, like, there's an ATL on the side there? which is which is a cool cool look because i like how so far the alliance is like doing the traditional you know football team stuff but they're also putting their own pizzazz on there now i know in the helmet section of this of this show uh we kind of were hard on the birmingham iron for a little missed opportunity now that you see the full look there what are your thoughts the pants socks and jersey look great the helmet color choice works really well. Love the look. Give me the logo. I don't understand. It doesn't make the look look any better or more cohesive if you don't include it. I think it would personally look better to me, but nobody asked me. So, but I'm and I'm confused by why there's not even a number on there. Like it's just black. It's like I I don't know. But overall, like good look, great look, Birmingham Iron. I just feel like the helmet could have been a little more the memphis express here i think it's a clean look i think it's a clean got the blue jersey with the red pants with the blue socks like i think it looks it, it looks good it's in you know good application of the colors got a little stripe thing on the side like i dig it i, I dig it i dig it a lot How, what do you think i think this one more than almost any other one that they created looks like they took it off of an arena team um I'm not in love with the shoulders at all. I'd prefer it to be either all blue or do the shoulders a little little more differently, almost more like how the Apollos did it. Um, that, that It just throws me off just a little too much. The helmet, the pants, the socks, and a blue jersey I think works really well. I think this was just an attempt to do something creative that doesn't work as well for me, but it doesn't look bad. Now, San Antonio Commanders here, they got the fire helmet here. So overall look, including the uniform, what are your thoughts? Uh, the bright red jersey with the maroon accents and the maroon accents in the gray pants, maroon socks. I, I it's great this this is great there's a little white in their logo as well and that's where the numbers come from being white it's just a really clean look it's a unique look um, it's unlike something that we see in like the NFL right now and it's not really something we're seeing done in college and I it's one of my favorite looks now Arizona they went with the yellow jersey with the yellow helmet um yellow jerseys um bit of a risk um for me because i've seen a lot of yellow jerseys that are not like good at all i don't hate the uniform it's definitely not one of my favorites but i think that's just more of a function of the colors the color scheme that they decided to go with um i'm not big on yellow but i don't think it's bad to me this looks like a one-off alternate uniform that a team was trying like they're 
primary look is supposed to be green and they're like we're gonna pull out the yellow jerseys this this game and like the fans react negatively and then they never wear them again uh, the orange collar is weird to me i get it's in their logo or is it red it's whatever their other color is um i either want more or less of it the green shoulders it's it's a lot i don't completely hate it though it's weird because i'm conflicted because i looking at it I think it works as a cohesive look. I just, I don't know that I like it, but I don't know that I hate it. We'll call it conflicted. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I know that we gave the helmet crown to San Antonio. However, I would submit, and I'm pretty sure TJ agrees with me, that the overall package of a uniform championship goes to the San Diego fleet because the the color scheme the way they use their colors the way they use the accents the way they design this entire look from the helmet down to the socks it's to me it's masterful conceptually it's perfect to me i can't there's nothing i can nitpick in it it is super clean it is something i would be very proud of if i was a fan or if i was someone who lived in the area that is fantastic that's phenomenal San Diego, congratulations, you have a team, and they look cool. Salt Lake Stallions here. Like in the helmet fortune, because the picture we had of the helmet was actually the helmet looked white. But in the rendering of the entire uniform, the helmet looks more gray. So we don't know which one, but it looks it looks very sleek like i kind of wish like the detroit lions would call whoever made this put this together and kind of help them out because detroit had some gray things that weren't they were yeah tj's face says it all so but the salt lake stallions i really like their look i like the use i'm a fan of blues i definitely and particularly a fan of using multiple blues and making that work in a uniform so the gray looks great with the helmet the uniform with the light blue pants, the gray socks. Uh, this one, just like San Antonio, it's it's tone on tone. You get like a light blue, you get a dark blue. I love that as a pairing. I think it works. The helmet in gray, I think I like almost more than the helmet in white. Um, the gray helmet or the gray jersey, the gray socks, gray shoes, sho shooting sleeves. I can't talk. I think it's a really cool look. Um, I really like it. I'm very excited to see what that looks like on the field. Um, because it could translate even better than what just this picture does. And um, yeah, if it wasn't for the fleet, I think that they would probably be, well, well them or San Antonio would be my favorites. Like all of the uniforms, like the Alliance continues to impress me just as far as like their rollout of things, how they're using social media, the designs, all the designs they're coming out with, you know, the only thing that we really had a big problem with was the one part that they didn't actually do a design where it's like, that's really so because all of the designs they're coming out with, you know, we're big fans of. I'm excited. They start play February of 2019. So I'm excited to see how all this translates on the field. I've been on board with the Alliance since I first watched the announcement reveal video when they were, they pitched such a good well put together you know timeline of what everything was going to be and they've stayed true to it their social media is fantastic the tv deal was already in place before they started that's crazy i'm i'm all in with the alliance and i'm gonna watch as much as i can i fully support this so those are our thoughts on you know the new uniforms and everything is going on with the alliance let us know what you think about the uniforms what's your favorite uniform what team are you going to support next season you know the inaugural alliance season so uh yeah and be sure you know to follow this young man over here because this guy has a podcast for the love of story you yeah, tell us a little bit about for the love story for this for the love of story podcast branded very nicely by this guy did all the logos he's great uh, but For the Love of Story podcast was a idea I had where basically it's part audiobook and part guest interviews and part original writings by myself um, where I just write and share stories for the love of them. And I have a lot of fun. I put out episodes uh, on Truly Tuesdays. Uh, right now I'm preparing my season two, 
which will be coming out sometime after the calendar year turns over. So yeah, that's it for us on this episode. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And, you know, let us know what you think about the uniforms and the helmets and everything along the lines of the Alliance of American Football. And remember, as you go along in life, teachers you learn and inspire as you do. See you next time.